Bloop, go tell mommy we're gonna be late. Go tell mommy we're gonna be late. Go tell her 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 we're gonna be late. Go. Oh, you think you bad? You not scared? You think you bad? The tongue. Yeah, that's what I thought. Babe! Yes? Are you ready? Almost. Yeah, you're ready. So you're not ready? No. You know we gotta leave in like five minutes, right? Five? Yeah, five. Oh my god. Or we're gonna be late. Look like we're gonna be late then. Oh my. Ah. Alright guys, while we wait, I just wanna show you my blueberry tree. Oh yeah, don't mind this. We had a really bad uh, thunderstorm and yeah, so this whole thing ripped off. So that, that's great for us. But yeah, you guys already know my money trees, nice, happy, healthy, growing, very big. And then we got a blueberry tree. It's not even a tree, it's just a twig at this point. We got it maybe like two weeks ago. It was full of leaves, had mad blueberries. It was looking crazy. We were eating them, they tasted great. And then I don't know what happened. I guess it dried out and all the leaves started falling off. So I basically plucked all the leaves off and I transferred it to this new pot with a bunch of new fresh dirt. So I'm hoping that it comes back alive. Well, like I know it's not dead, but you know, I hope it just starts producing more blueberries again. Your boy is sad. I wish I would have kept the picture I took on my phone. You could have seen it looked just like a crazy nice tree and now it just looks really sad so i'm kind of sad myself i'm gonna get it back don't okay well i don't know what that bug is right there but it's got a red stinger i am not messing with that we are going back inside this is honestly so annoying because of this we can't go really back there because the bugs at night or in the evening are really crazy and we like to spend a lot of time here but yeah whatever that red stinger flying thing was i am messing with it the house looks like it has a cape this is crazy the house is a superhero low key. But yeah guys, I don't know what's going on with that blueberry tree. If you guys have any insights or any knowledge on blueberry trees, comment down below what I should do. I don't know what went wrong. It says it's also supposed to be in direct sunlight. Um, I've been doing that as well. Obviously not right now because it's a little cloudy. But yeah, help me get the blueberry tree back to where it needs to be. And hopefully someone comes and fix this because this just looks wild. And we are finally out the door. Damn, babe, I gotta wash your car. Oh, it's disgusting. Oh my God, have some class, Janice. Yeah, I'm washing the cars? Yes. This is your car. You're supposed to wash your own car. No, that's your job. You like washing people's cars so much, you do it. Yeah, you're right, you're right, you're right. What's going on, guys? Welcome back to another video. So, as you guys are probably wondering, where is my car? You guys didn't see it in the garage. You guys know we're not in it right now. This is Janice's car. Mm -hmm. um, my car right now is missing because it is in Orlando. Mm -hmm. A whole three and a half hours away. Three and a half? Where do you get three and a half? I'm just kidding. It's more like two hours away. Yeah, it's like two hours away. It's a little bit of a drive. Um, I'm not going to say exactly what's getting done to the car, but it's getting some work done, some performance stuff. All right, mm -hmm. we're, we're going to make it go faster. But yeah, that, that's why my car is missing. And we're going to pick it up hopefully within the next week or so. Yeah, Isaiah every day is like, do you think my car's okay? Do you think my no, car's seriously, okay? No, seriously, seriously. Do you think it's all right? It's fine. It's a car. It doesn't have feelings. It's not living. Do not talk about it like that. I am so over him. Like, I cannot. Guys, all right. So, the guy's been giving me updates. He's been texting me, like, letting me know he's done with this, he's done with that. And I'm honestly so excited. And I can't wait to show you guys. And, yeah, we're going to make a video about it. It's going to be crazy. Mm-hmm. All right. So, you done talking about your car? I could go on and on. This whole video will be about my car, but I'm going to stop right here. So, you're going to tell them what we're doing? Um, yeah, so right now we are actually on the way to the chiropractor. We're gonna go and get adjusted, as Janice would say. I like mm -hmm. saying cracked. No. Um, we're gonna go get cracked. But after that, we made it a thing where we're gonna go to the mall now because Janice insists that I take my style, my dressing, um, a little more serious. I don't, first of all, you're making it seem like I said that you like dress bad. No, 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 no. But you I, you guys know, all I do is wear white tees or black tees. I don't really wear like anything graphic. This is like one of the very few times that I do. Um, I don't know, I for me myself, I kind of like just want to go on a little shopping spree, nothing too crazy. Um, just start dressing, I guess, a little nicer. Mm -hmm. And he asked me to help him put some outfits together. So I said, it's better to like be in person and try them on so you know how they feel. Online shopping, when you're trying to like change your whole style is just difficult. So yes that's what we're doing today so i mean we're gonna go hit the big mall in tampa and they should have a lot of stores to pick from mm -hmm. all right and she's basically gonna be picking stuff out from you you know like oh this would look good on you so on and so forth and we're gonna vlog it out you guys are gonna be able to give your opinions as well in the comments but yeah 
that's uh, that's gonna be today's vlog. Yes, yeah, so it's gonna be a lot of fun. So we will catch you guys when we're out of the chiropractor's office. So we just got out of the chiropractor and update. We got some Starbies. This stuff slaps. Oh my god! <laughs> Mango dragon fruit lemonade. No inclusions. Fire. I just got the peach green tea it's so good and i was gonna add raspberry sweetener but it doesn't even need it it's just so good on its own and did y'all know that they discontinued the raspberry sweetener like the syrup you're pointing the camera at me like that because you're supposed for to be me. like oh, i don't care for that i care i want no raspberry syrup What's crazy is that I never had raspberry syrup before, so I don't know why I'm being extra. But exactly. anyway, we are now on our way to the mall. Yeah, we got about a half hour drive. Mm -hmm. I don't know why it's a little longer than usual. I hope there's not traffic. I mean, it's probably the time, honestly, because it's around lunchtime and you know, a lot of people go out or whatever. They need to go back home because I don't want to be in no traffic. So, period. Yeah. Guys, I want to tell you. So, yesterday, I don't know if you can tell. <laughs> so, I wanted to get a shag haircut, right? And I get in these like random moods where at night I go crazy and I just do things like do my nails or like do drastic changes to my appearance. Not the best ideas. Yeah, but I don't know. I think it's an anxiety thing or insomnia thing, but whatever. Nonetheless, I cut my bangs. I cut bangs yesterday because my hair is kind of damaged so I'm just gonna be like chopping at it little by little but I did some little um, like fringe kind of shaggy bangs and I'm not gonna lie when my hair gets really really curly it does not look cute so I had to go in the bathroom at the chiropractor's office and I just wet my hair guys she comes out I'm waiting for her outside she comes outside with her hair just mad wet and I'm like yo what the what just happened in there? I was just like, mm, girl, you was looking a little poofy. And we about to go to the mall. I can't let nobody see me looking like a whole ass wet dog. Bro, so that's how you came out of the chiropractor looking. Yeah, but now I look cute. So Period. what you got to say about it now? Got nothing. You want to fight? I'm getting like fight vibes from you. We can fight. No, I don't want to fight. I just want you to call me beautiful. You're beautiful. <laughs> You're beautiful. You don't need me to tell you that, though. Thank you. But yeah, guys. So I don't know. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you think. But yeah, we're gonna catch you guys when we get to the mall, right? That's right. Oh, before that, I did my nerves. Do you see them? I put a lot of effort. Okay, now we could see you guys at the mall. I just had to show you everything that I did. <laughs> First stop already, Nordstrom. And it's not even for me. I wanna see, I don't know if Nordstrom's the one that got skims, but I'd be needing some skims. Let's see if they got my size. Though. Babe, I don't think skims is something that I can wear. <laughs> I need something. Um, today was about me. That doesn't mean I can't go shopping too. We're already here. Mm, this is why. Why? Ooh, what? Mm, mm. All right, so we're in H and M right now. She did not find anything for Skims, and neither did I. So she picked out this for me. I'm, I'm not gonna lie, babe. I don't know how I feel about this. I'm just asking you. If this is something you would wear. I know I'm plain, but I feel like this is really plain. Like, I don't know. I want some pizzazz in my style. Well, baby, start looking. Give me some drip. Give you some drip. Guys, he is so picky. He doesn't like anything. Every time I point something out, he's like, mm, now. Guys, it's hard for me because I'm going for a specific look and I can't find exactly what I'm looking for. So it's a little irritating, but we're going to get to it. We're going we're gonna to find it. It's hard for me, guys. So stressed. <laughs> I'm looking at these jeans, right? Janice is telling me that they're purple. They have a purple hue to it. Definitely. How, bro? Unless I'm tripping, I don't see purple. It's gray, but like it has like a purple tone. I like don't... a purple undertone to it. I mean, I guess I can see that. Like put it next to something lavender like this. Like same tone. Nah, man, look at it under the light. That is just gray. Oh, whatever. Nice jeans though. Yeah. So Isaiah is like, do you think I could pull that off, right? I feel like I can't. Like, I love stuff like this. It's more like a street style wear. Mm -hmm. But I just don't know. Like, this is my problem. I never know what to pair it with. I feel like you have to find sneakers first. He has no sneakers that match that. You don't? Nah, white sneakers wouldn't work. Right? White sneakers is just basic. Like, you need to find some cool sneakers that have both of those colors in it and get a nice graphic tee. And that's a nice fit with a nice hat. Okay. Now, let me be basic about it. Mm -hmm. White tee like I always do. Okay. These shorts okay. with some crispy icy whites. Some Air Force ones. If you want to be like plain Jane about it, yeah. But that means that that's going to be the statement piece. Right. Hope I don't it should do, be statement. 
I don't want to do too much because it's just not me. Like, I'm also trying to keep my personality in it. Mm -hmm. But I don't know. I mean, these are really cool. And I think these are these are swim shorts. <laughs> Janice gets the best luck when it comes to shopping. She ended up getting some Celine shades. They look fire. Now she's over here shopping for earrings. And then here I am, empty-handed. I got nothing. Nothing. You're just too picky. I am picky, but I want to be comfortable in what I wear, and I also want to like what I wear. So, sorry. This is what I'm talking about. She just found a bunch of more clothes. Guys, I gained my weight. This booty getting fat, so guess what? Gotta go up hand sizes. That, that was never a problem. Eating good, what can I say? So yeah, guys, I think I got some luck in here. This is kind of like the style I want to go for, like simple, classy, like airy. I don't want to say beachy vibes, but you know, keeping it classy, keeping it clean, stuff like this. So I'm gonna pick out some stuff right here with the help of Janice, and then, you know, we're gonna see what, what happens. He needs this color. Like, oh, let's, let's try it on. His skin let's. tone up with that. Oh my goodness. Jeez. Ooh, damn, and the tats. Oh my gosh. Please be my baby daddy soon. Hmm? It looks good though. Yeah, did you hear what I just said? You said what? <laughs> Nothing. What'd you I say? I know the infinite fam heard. What'd you say? Y'all heard me. What'd you say? <laughs> I said, please be my baby daddy soon. <laughs> Should we take it back to the fitter room? Whoa, whoa. Nah, that's ratchet. <laughs> Finally. I finally found some freaking clothes. Yeah. It's about time. Out of, out of my 25 years of living, I finally got some decent clothes. I'm very happy for you, babe. Thank you so much. You're welcome. It is looking really, really good. It is looking really good. We got a bunch, a bunch of shorts. The boy got a bunch of shirts. It's looking really good. Today's looking really successful. In my kitchen, you never listen. Alright guys, so we stopped at Rocco's Tacos. Apparently this is a really good Mexican spot. Our friends told us so. We're trying it out. We got some chips and salsa and guac as you just saw. Uh, well, actually no. Where's the guac? Waiting on it. Alright, I, I guess they're going to come and make it for us. I don't know. But, so we're going to try all this Mexican food out. I am so happy. We are done shopping. Your boy got a bunch of stuff finally with the help of his baby girl, future wife over here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Just stuff in your face. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. Taste test. Big, big bite. Mm. Is it fresh? Mm -hmm. it spicy? No. It's good. How would you rate it? Ten. Ten? Really? Interesting. And you know it's fresh. Yo, one of these ladies in traffic almost got a knuckle sandwich. She's right next to us. This what? girl is texting on her phone while driving. She's don't gonna do get that a knuckle sandwich. I'm not gonna hit her because I don't do that. That's gonna be your. I'll job. hit her. But I'm gonna give her a knuckle sandwich. <laughs> what you just said? <laughs> I said I'll hit her. I know you will, but it's alright at that point because you can do that. I can't. But I will give her a knuckle sandwich. I think that's my biggest pet peeve. I fi I think I figured that out. She over there nothing, like going into our lane yeah. and stuff like, bro, stay in your lane, get off the phone, bro. No, nothing pisses me off more than you texting <laughs> and she's on the phone while driving. She's old. Old lady about it. Y'all, I'm gonna give her a bald spot later. <laughs> give her all that friction on the knuckle sandwich. Oh my God. It's crazy because like, do you not care about the lives around you? Or if somebody's in your car and you're texting and driving, oh my God. Like, do you not care about the lives that are in your car? That's just such disrespect. But anyway. Yeah, we left them all. <sighs> yeah. Um, clearly. But overall, I am so happy. I was telling her when we were eating, this is the most successful mall day I've ever had in my life. Yeah. I've got so many nice clothes. I just need shoes now. And I told him, I was like, this mall is not like any mall that we've been to. Jersey don't have nothing good. Everything's shit. So I'm like... I'm telling you, this is the mall that you want to go to to look around and go to stores because they have everything and anything. And he was getting a little doubtful in the beginning. Because we went to like two to three stores, you guys saw, all right? And I wasn't finding anything. You were finding everything, which was just like a slap in the face. Because I'm like, she always finds mm. everything. I can never find nothing. 
Oh, but babe. it's all right. I, I got, you know, pretty much what I needed. All right, so I'm feeling good. And like I said, I just need to get shoes, and you got to help me with that because I got a bunch of sneakers and Jordans and stuff like that. But nothing classy. Yeah, I can't wear that type of stuff with the clothes that I bought. Yeah, so I'm about to do some research, and we're just going to end the vlog right here. I feel like today was such a good day. It made me so emotional seeing him happy because... I don't know, he just deserves a world. He deserves to be happy and have clothes that he feels good in. But anyway, guys, Thanks, with babe. all that being said, wait, do you wait, have wait. anything you want wait. to say? Yes, you know what was my highlight of the day? What? Not even the clothes. What? When you were like, oh, can you make me, can you be my baby daddy? I was like, mm. Yeah, well, you should be my baby <laughs> Yeah, you better stop talking like that. Next video is going to be like, guys, we conceive. <laughs> Alright guys, so with all of that being said, we love you. We hope you enjoyed today's vlog and we will catch you in the next video. Love you guys.